Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. Or if you're new here, I'm Laura. And I'm Ryan and we are Disney Pin Love. <laughs> yes, so there's nothing to say to that because today has nothing to do with Disney pins. But if you like snacks, stay tuned for today's yes. video because we have tasting. our second snack crate. So and I'm our, gonna... Our third tasting video. Have you had enough? I hope not because these are really fun to make. So. Da, 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 da. We're going to Poland. So that's exciting. Yeah. And funny, uh, funny story there. I suppose I am technically a quarter Polish, but I don't really, we don't know much about that in, uh, in my family. So it would have been on my, uh, my dad's side, my grandpa mm -hmm. being born in Poland. I never met the man. He died when my dad was very young, and that was sort of uh, the extent of it, I suppose. So, <laughs> you know, I'm interested in uh, in the place for sure. Yeah, perfect. Well, thanks for keeping them entertained while I worked my magic. So I just pulled everything out of the box. Um, as with all the snack crates, if you do not know, they come with like quite the description and information sheet inside there. So I'm just gonna set that aside and take a look later. But we have some exciting things in front yeah, of us. Yeah, it looks like it. So before we get started, of course, this is a snack crate. So if you don't know what that is, every month they send you stuff from a different country. So last month it was Hong Kong. Yep. This month it's Poland. Next month it's something really exciting. It's already yeah, arrived man. and I've taken a peek and Ryan just dropped a hint there. So <laughs> yeah, so they send you fun snacks from the specific country and uh, today we're just going to try them and let you know what we think. So yeah. what it looks like kind of there's one savory item and maybe the rest is all kind of sweet. So what should we start with the savory? Let's do it. I okay. think that's a pattern. So I will show you guys after I crinkle it and make a big noise. So there's the package there. So based on the um, information sheet, it says both nutritious and delicious. These pretzel crackers are topped with sesame, chia, and flax seeds and sprinkled with a flurry of provincial herbs. Yeah. Do you want to try to say what they're called? Yes. Why Picarnia Bajgul. How's that? Bajgul. How's my yeah. Polish? <laughs> yeah, no, neither of us have any, uh, I'm sure one of our many thousands of viewers in Poland will uh, have a good laugh and correct <laughs> us. Yeah, okay, so this is just a nice, easy, whoops, oh, pull Yeah, I, I always love looking at these, the sort of accompanying <gasps> features and these oh my God. potato things are just, have, have distracted me and uh, caught all of my attention. Wow. Okay, smell it guys, smell it, because we know that works, just like the pixie, Get closer dust, to your pixie TV. dust apothecary. We can smell your yeah. candles through here. Like, that oh, yeah. is, like, I'm here for Hot the smell. Hot damn, okay. give me one. So, oh, oh, <laughs> show them. So it's like a little tiny mini bagel. So, oh my gosh, don't bite my finger off. Mmm, mm-hmm. Mmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Or slow it down to make it more sensual. Mm. <laughs> well, that's friggin' good. Those are really good. I'm trying to like, I mean, I can't read Polish, but I'm really trying. Oh, there's English. You can barely I'm... read English at the <laughs> best of times. But... I'm trying to identify the flavor that I smelled as soon as I opened it and that Rosemary. I really like. Yeah, so it's like basil, marjoram, which I'm unsure of what that is, rosemary, sage, oregano, thyme, and mint. So those are all the, the flurry of seasonings that are on it. So that's really good. I'm yeah, nervous. That, that is very nice. Let's cleanse our palate and we'll come back with some sweet items. All right. Some good Polish vodka. Mm -hmm. Straight up. Yeah. So what should we do next? So many things. I think we should get into uh, to these. Okay. And so, then we're into the really, I think, treat-like things. Okay, so show them and then... It's rice cakes with Belgian milk chocolate. 
Yeah, so it says these crispy, crunchy rice cakes are coated in a thick layer of decadent Belgian milk chocolate, making it the perfect snack to get you through a long day. We need those scissors. Yes, please. Snip, snip. Okay. Oh, it's a is it a full size one? So we'll yeah, just share the we'll, same one. Uh, we'll crack it. Yeah, we'll just bite from the same one. So, so. it's. So. Mmm. Neat. Yeah. I, I used like I always used to eat rice cakes as a kid. Think. Oh, Mickey ears. Nice. Very creative. Well, this is gonna make a mess. Well, so that's okay. Do you want to just try things. to break it in no, half? No, just or take just a bite and then bite. pass it to me. Oh, it didn't make any no, mess. No, it didn't make any mess. Oh, it smells like a rice cake. Mm. Yeah, you get to... Mm. So, my take is you get the uh, just sort of that plain rice cake kind of flavor off the head, but then the, the chocolate starts to melt a bit as you go and, and blends in, and it's quite nice again. Mm. Yeah. I really like that. That's delicious. I feel like I'd buy those for my lunches if they had them in Canada. Or I could like make my own. And the chocolate is very nice. It's mm -hmm. not, like it, it doesn't, you know, taste fake. It's not too bitter. It's not too sweet. It's... No, that's really good. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to pick the next thing. So I'm going to go with this because I feel like it'll kind of work after that. But so this is a Prince Polo. So who knows what that is? Nice shiny packaging. So the Prince Polo... A true Polish favorite, this delectable treat features layers of crunchy wafer sandwiched together with chocolate cream then coated in milk chocolate. Oh, hell yeah. Extra chocolate for this one. I guess everything's just on the one side that we have today. Yeah, I guess for snack crates you can get sort of the, uh, the bigger one that, uh, you know, includes more mm. items and usually some sort of liquid item. Yeah, I like Polish food. It's not as sweet. Yeah, that's well, what... we, should, we should go check out the, uh, the home country. Mm. Oh, sounds nice. I always like to sniff my food before I mm. bite it. Mm. Yeah, that's really nice again. Yeah. This is, I don't know. I, so with snack crate videos, do you prefer, it's probably more fun to watch when the people don't like the food, right? That's, oh, yeah. that's more entertaining. It for sure is. Yeah, Abby, Kate, and Karen just did a... Asian snack tasting and it was hilarious when they tried like <laughs> crab chips that Karen wanted to get because they did not like it. So yeah, it is more fun. But... How many should we start using Andy heads? Yeah, to read it. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> we'll just... But check out overview. Disney Inside Andy anyways. Yeah. yeah. So do you want to pick the next thing? Yeah, I'm going to go with uh, with this. This looks, this is really interesting looking to me. Okay. Ooh, you're going to like this. So it says, made from a recipe that dates back over 700 years, this deliciously soft, heart-shaped gingerbread cookie oh, okay. has just the, amount of spice, just the right amount of spice in every bite. That okay. sounds delicious. So it looks like it's going to be soft. Yes, it is. Oh my it god, it looks like, it's like glazed almost. It's almost too beautiful to Ooh. eat. Looks like it could, yeah. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm just going to go for it. Okay. Oh, it's like really like, oh, mm. really light. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. That has? Yeah, I mm. like that. It is, it is spiced pretty nicely, mm -hmm. like compared to, you know, I guess more common kind of gingerbread that you might have here. I, I'm liking all this stuff. I, I don't know yeah, like, like, why are we living here in Canada like suckers when we I know. could be, it's you know, true. just eating this great stuff every day in Poland. <laughs> yeah, no, that's that's really good. Like, if we weren't on camera, like, I would keep eating this, but we'll save it for, like, coffee later today. Go to today. Euro Itchy and Scratchy <laughs> Land and, uh, no. What? Euro Disneyland. Oh. <laughs> Simpsons reference worked in there. Wait. J okay. All right, show them, and I I'll will have eat some it. more vodka, please. Okay, it's not vodka. Okay, so this next thing that Ryan's going to show you is this crunchy cookie bar layers caramel, hazelnuts, and crispy rice, all coated in creamy milk chocolate, to satisfy even your most intense cravings. I don't know about the rice. I don't know about the rice. In oh, this. you're no. It's like a we have a chocolate bar like that. You're going to like it. It's just like a rice crispy. Okay. Right. 
It's so gonna this be is good. what it looks like, uncovered, oh my gosh. naked. There it is. You can't really kind of see the layers, but there's the inside there. Let's try a bite after we sniff it. Mm -hmm. It's good. I think mm -hmm. it's my least favorite thing so far because I find the chocolate a bit overbearing. Mm -hmm. mm. I mean, it's not bad. I'm going to eat it. Literally none of this is going to waste because I'm going to eat it all. Even those bagel chips. I kind of forgot we got those, but... Yeah, yeah, right off the hop. That's really cool. good. Okay, so we have... Vodka? Yeah, I think so. I'm just going to kind of look what these are. I don't think I want to open... Well, we can open them. Okay, so we have three fresh fruity snacks. And uh, I... Well, they we all have be, pineapples, we're lime, them and lemon. We're going to eat them all. We're just going to each have half because they look kind of like a big like cube. But so these are called Wawl Fresh and Fruity. Looking for a delicious way to enjoy some fruity goodness? These chewy gummies are filled with sweet fruit jelly for a burst of freshness in every bite. Oh, it sounds healthy. <laughs> so we'll have yeah. between us, I guess, because we'll split them, we'll still have like three servings of fruit right here, probably. Yeah, yeah, they're totally healthy. So this one has pineapple, orange, and lemon. Mm -hmm. Oh, and lime on the outside. Mm -hmm. Oh, they all do. Mm. Oh, so it's like, oh, it's like a little gumdrop. The inside, the, it's more liquidy than I expected, but I'm I'm here for it. Oh, it's yeah. It's very I used, decadent. I used to have something like this as a kid. Around Christmas, they'd come out with like real fruit gummies, like in like a tin, and they were shaped like the little like orange slices. We're making a mm. huge mess here, but this is, uh, this is fantastic. YOLO, this is great. I know we said we'd cancel like our snack crate after the first month or two but i'm just gonna keep it running remember when you said we'd only do one video a week in january yeah yeah and now we do three hmm. whatever Ooh, this one's pink yeah it's like it's beautiful mm. what that's even better they're very strong like even the smell oh mm. like raspberry mm -hmm. Okay, last wow. one. I just don't want it to end. I'm gonna eat all of this this afternoon, Mike. I wanna know now. I, I actually <laughs> wanna know more about Polish food now and uh, what some, some really popular like main courses would be. Yeah. I think pierogies are, well, are almost a cliche. I think they're, you know, quite famous. There's one of their dishes is some like thinly sliced fried potatoes kind of thing. That looks good. I'd be here for that. My uh, my parents got to Poland just, uh, I guess, shortly before COVID and yeah. to, to explore a little because I think my dad, due to the whole family story, has, has had some curiosity. So yeah, no, I'm really happy that they got to check it out and mm -hmm. add it to the list for us. I forgot to smell it. <laughs> Those are really good. Mm -hmm. Like, just like a cool texture. They're like so strong. Like, yeah, very potent, but it's just a nice, it's a nice flavor. I can't pick a favorite between those, but probably the. I like the middle one. Probably the green one. But those were all amazing. Like, yeah, yeah. everything. This was great. <laughs> so sorry for the disappointment if you like coming to snack videos for the gross food. But yeah. that was really good, so. Yeah, and a lot of different stuff, too. Like, it seemed like we even maybe had one more thing than we normally Yeah, get. well, like, so in the full-size chocolate one, bars, like. One, two, three, four, five, six, depending how you count the little things, like, sort of six different things, and it was yeah. six for six. Yeah, I mean, the value is kind of there. Like, this, so the, our first box was fourteen ninety nine because we had a $5 discount, um, but now they're nineteen ninety nine. but even that, for, like, once a month for like kind of a fun chance to try some different things. I'm here for it. So now we can watch Irresistible Magic's video because awesome. I was holding off because they also got a Poland snack crate. So, I mean, if you don't know who they are, go check them out. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to watch and see what they thought of all this stuff and uh, if they had the same items. Let's go do it. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I can't pick a favorite. I loved it all. So <laughs> let us know in the comments down below if there's anything that you'd be curious to try. Um, Anything else? Have you been to Poland? That's pretty yeah. random, but maybe you have.
Yeah. So there you go. Yeah. So thanks everybody for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye.